What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. How are you feeling today, my Cowboys people? Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here? All right, we've taken the first step of a four-step process. And we'll see what we're going to see on Sunday. We've got the countdown clock counting down. But, you know, it's so funny to me. It's so funny. Uh, did my morning video and everything else. I've been out in the workshop doing some work. I've had to get my chain and stuff together here. And I'm reading some of the comments and things. And, you know, sometimes some of you people can make you sick. I talked about the performance that our quarterback had. And, of course, everybody's like, oh, well, that was just Tampa Bay. You know, it was just Tampa Bay. You know, they had nobody. You know how many times this year that somebody has scored four touchdowns on Tampa Bay this year? Twice. You know how many times somebody scored four touchdowns on Tampa Bay without an interception? Once. Dak Prescott and the Dallas Cowboys had the offensive performance. Dak Prescott was better than anybody else this weekend, a quarterback. Let's be clear here. Yeah, you could say, well, Trevor Lawrence had four TDs, but he also had four interceptions to go with it and 288 yards. You could say, well, Josh Allen, Josh Allen was doing great things against the Miami Dolphins. Josh Allen did have 352 yards and three TDs, but had two interceptions to go with it. You had Tom Brady, who literally tried to slide tackle Hooker, by the way, that was some cheap shit you did there, Tom. Cheap shit. I imagine what your divorce attorney was must have been like. That was an incredible performance by the quarterback. All week, all week we've been hearing Dak Prescott has a one in three playoff record. Dak Prescott hasn't won a road playoff game. Dak Prescott can't throw interceptions. But see, here's what I got in one of my comments. That was a team win. Technically, you are 100% right because you can take the greatest quarterback in the world and you can't put me as a wide receiver and think you're going to win just because you got that guy, which is true. It is a true statement. But in the context of everything that's going on here, now is going to be the time when you're actually going to say it correctly? That was a team win. You literally, it will literally hurt you all to say that Dak Prescott is a good quarterback. Is he perfect? No. Well, he was damn near last night with the 146 QBR rating. He was definitely large and in charge of that game. Why is it so difficult for people to say, you know what? That was a good game. I have been wrong about what I've said about you. When you get jackasses like Dan Orlowski literally saying he's the 12th best quarterback in the playoffs, you might want to revisit that one. I wanted to hear what Stephen A. Smith had to say today. So I want to play that this moment, and let's check it out. Are you confident now, after that performance by Dak Prescott, that he can get his team to the Super Bowl? Nah, I'm not. Nah. I'm not, I mean, I mean I'm, not, I'm not going there. I'm not going there. You know, look, 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 look. look. Uh, you know. Yeah. What time is it? The, look, look, all right, look, 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 look. They had a good night. All right, they had a good night. All right, mm -hmm. uh, congratulations to the Dallas mm -hmm. Cowboys. Um, <laughs> they were the better team. I knew they were the better team, but I didn't expect this. Are you not I'm shocked. I'm shocked at how Are bad they made Tom Brady look. I'm shocked at the no show that was Leonard Fournette. Why you were here? I'm shocked at 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 the ineffectiveness that 
I didn't. I saw it through the season, but I didn't expect it to be there last night. I got to give Dallas the respect where it's due. They beat. They beat an inferior team, and they exposed the team for being inferior. I didn't expect that. I expected the Dallas Cowboys to implode. Mm -hmm. I expected them to collapse like mm -hmm. a cheap tent for crying out loud. I uh -huh. really, really did. I did. And they shocked me. They shocked me. Props to Dak Prescott. Mm -hmm. Props to him. No doubt about it. He came out there. He showed up. He showed out. And the defense was sensational. There's no doubt about it. They just neutralized. They beat up on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, all right? But I'm not going to go far and, and say this uh, about Dak Prescott leading him to the Super Bowl. A matter of fact, Swag Goo. And Keyshawn, y'all supposed to be my boys, but that's all right. That's all right. Not <laughs> let me tell y'all something. Let me tell you. Let me, you watch your mouth, man. You watch your mouth, man. Let me say this to y'all. I think you're missing a very key, key point here. The Dallas Cowboys should thank me. They For should what? thank me. They For should what? thank me. Listen, I mean... listen. I served as the ultimate source of motivation. I talked a little bit too much. I'm tired. I talked a little bit too to much. I fed off of the stuff that happened with the commanders a week earlier in the nation's capital. You understand? And I, I served as a source of We're inspiration. Not listening. No. No. We're not listening to that today. I mean, should they should thank me. They should thank me. What did I text you this morning? I was so mad at First Take Producers as a diehard Giants fan that I had to wear a Cowboys jersey on First Take, but I'm a team player. We're promoting the game. I wear a Dak jersey once. He has the best performance of his life. And oh, Lordy. Now, first time Swaggo. In years. Appreciate you, Molly. Yeah. Appreciate Swaggo, Keyshawn, yes. do y'all know that Molly texted me with that 6 o'clock this morning? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She texted me with that. that. She brought yeah. that yeah. good car. She shouldn't have, she shouldn't have yeah. never <sighs> let you go to sleep. Molly, no. She should have been sitting Molly, no. Sports Center highlights yep. all night long. You should have been sitting in your room, wherever you at, sitting there and no, watching no, Sports no, Center key, all night long. Key, he should have went right back to that damn set he was at in Tampa and they, watched the too. game by itself. Yeah. He should have yeah. sat there they all night. You, all night. And let the people form another shot. line so they could see you this morning. That's what you should have did. Like you an airplane. Went back to the, where, where were y'all, Molly? Where were y'all? We were at the convention the con center. Yeah, you should have went back to the convention center and told everybody, fuck, we going to be there. We going to be, yeah, I'm going to be in the house. I'm going to be, I want all the fans to come out. That's what you should have did so the people can come get their justification in the middle of the square. So let me That's ask what you this, they Stephen, eh? He so do you think do you think Dak Prescott can lead this team to the Super Bowl based on his performance that you saw against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in the way that he played? Don't look at the numbers. Damn the right. numbers. The performance Just look at last the way time. that he played. Look at the right. things that he did. How he manipulated right. the defense and moved the secondary with his eyes. Right. It delivered right. the football in sync. It did those sort of things. Can he lead this team to the Super Bowl? Because I think he can. I think well, that ain't gonna happen. Can. That ain't gonna happen again. It, that ain't gonna oh, happen again. Really? Look, 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 we oh, got that all you week think? to get into. We you got think, all week to get into. You think he it, gonna lay a stinker? That ain't gonna happen again. You think he get ready to lay a stinker? Happen again? What? I do. What? I expect it for it to happen again, and oh, again no, and again. I, no, I, I do. I don't. Hold I on, do. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, I expect for him to continue to play this way because he understands. What? What? No, no. You saying again and again? Is that you implying that you think the Cowboys are going to the Super Bowl? We're going to take this victory, and we think the Cowboys are going to the Super Bowl? Is that I what y'all saying? Is that what y'all saying? I honestly do. I oh, honestly gonna do. Y'all going to lose I was How? ready to come eat so? my crow today. How so? I ain't eating that. Oh, y'all Why gonna, not? Oh, season. The season ends Dig, the dig yourself a deeper you hole. Dig a deeper. Who do you, who do you believe gonna in? Who do you going to dig Brock, yourself a Brock deep hole. Purdy, Danny Dimes, we don't even know if Jalen's 100%. Molly, Molly and Keyshawn, don't fall into this. See, this is what he do. No, I this want him to dig a hole. This is what he do when he's drowning. This is what he do when he's drowning. I done seen him drown before. I done seen him drown before. We know it's highly plausible that the San Francisco 49ers beat the Cowboys. See, he want to go to yeah. that week. Wait, he want to move Marcus, forward. Marcus, mm -hmm. He want to move forward. Hold up one second. Does anybody think that it's strange that Stephen A. planned his book tour today? Well, well, that well, he can you only, know, Molly, can only I'm not going to go there. He can only be here I'm not for like go 15 there. minutes of the show I'm not at the liberty today. to go there. He's got his book tour all day. I so just know. 
I just know if it was me, mm -hmm. or if it was Michael Irving, mm -hmm. or if it was Keyshawn Johnson, I know what type of energy would be towards us not being available to deal mm -hmm. with what we would have had to deal with if the Tampa Bay Buccaneers would have won this game. I just know, I know if that. Tom Brady smashed yeah. it, there would be no book toward it. Yeah, no you know, but, but, but let me say this, Key. First of all, hold on, hold on, hold on, before you go, go first of all, don't blame me. Blame Simon and Schuster, the mm -hmm. publisher, Okay, of my book, Straight Shooter, which is on shelves today everywhere. Everywhere. Again, All right? The, the point is this. The point is this. I didn't schedule it for today. They did. I am an innocent bystander in this. Oh. All I did was show up and fulfill my obligation. And then I sat up there and I said, you know what? I'm going to come on this set with my boys. I'm off today, but I'm going to come on the set with my boys and I get treated this it's way. Okay. Okay. But, you are smart, but, but the so thing convenient. is, Stephen A., you're a smart so businessman. <laughs> and you knew you know, damn so well convenient. that the Cowboys was probably going to beat the Bucks. <laughs> and then when they did, you looked at your schedule and said, damn. Key, Key, Good no, thing this is what off. happened. Key, you Good missing thing the, I'm you, you, you missing the big point, Key. It's the first time in history this man to let somebody else control his schedule. Now today, coincidence. Exactly. I had, I, I, today, right. today, right. today, the company controls my schedule yeah. because I because I just don't have any he, say so he in Stephen runs A's the world. Yeah. 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 Here with that. Yeah. Yes, today is a beautiful day for the Dallas Cowboys, but we can't enjoy it. We got work to do, but I'm just happy that we have return of the DAC. Oh, he's on the run. Well, I tried to tell you so, but I guess you did not know. As the story goes, Dak has got the flow, cause I knew it from the start, when Romo broke our heart, that we'd have to start again, you know it my friends, Skip and Shannon lied to you, all the things they said he could not Skip do, Skip and Shannon lied to you, yes they tried, yes they tried, 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 Skip and Shannon lied to you, even though Dak would die for you, disappointed there as far as how they played it. Return of the deck. Yes, it is. Return of the deck. Oh, my God. For the Cowboys. Dak throwing that way, and it's into the end zone. Does that impact you? He said, not really. It doesn't impact us. We do what we do. But he did say, I will thank Philadelphia for helping us get rolling. You know he'll be back. Here he is. Return of the deck once again. Return of the deck. Pump up the world. Return of the deck, watch him flow. You know he'll be back, here he goes. So he's back up in the game, running things to keep his swing, letting all the people know that he's back to run the show. Because what you did, all those nasty things you've done. So listen carefully while he plays his comeback game. Turn of the deck, yes it is. Return of the deck, yes it is. You know he'll be back, here he comes. Return of the deck, oh my God. Return of the deck, yes it is. Return of the deck, here he goes. So how is that for an immediate answer? I did not know he was that good. 45 yard seam routes on a dime, moving defenders, all the Tom Brady stuff. How y'all doing, everybody out there? You know, I know y'all thought <laughs> I was gonna lose this old bet old Carolina and Cleveland, but oh, oh, you know, got me 10 cases. Ain't nothing wrong. Y'all don't mind if I have me a little day cap of this old shade, do you? Good old day cap. Ain't nothing like winning 10 cases by 2 o'clock. You remember I told y'all we're gonna do something for two something. 
10 cases just like that. I know Skip was over there celebrating, talking about, oh, he did it again. He did it again. You remember those 11 games? I don't remember nothing. I remember I got 10 cases coming tomorrow. I see y'all.